Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's gonna be a wish haul slash TJ Maxx haul. So if you guys are into that kind of thing, go ahead and stay tuned. If not, I will catch you on the next one. Okay, so getting started, I went ahead and I ordered some stuff on Wish. I've ordered through them before. Everything is basically really inexpensive uh, dupes or fakes, should I say. I mean, not everybody can go out and buy all the bougie stuff, you know, the whole high maintenance and whatnot. And, and then some of us like to cut corners and save a buck here or two. I mean, if it's worth it, it's worth it. Not bashing on any brands, uh, but I feel like if it's worth it, it's worth it, and it is what it is. So the first thing on my agenda is going to be a brush holder. So the brush holder, it came in with about a, a week and a half exactly from the date that I ordered it, and this was only $4. So it was a dollar shipping, $3 for the container. Uh, so shipping varies on the size of the product that you're ordering. The bigger the product or the more product you order, the more shipping is going to come out. So, all in all, I was very happy and with my purchases that I made and the, I, you know, researched the app and whatnot. So, continuing on, I did go ahead and I got a brush belt. I should have waited a little bit or looked more and more because the one I really wanted was like a zipper up a zip up brush belt and I ended up ordering this one this one was three dollars with a dollar shipping four dollars total so I'm just going to tell you the total on the products that I put uh, total amount for the product that I purchased make it just a little bit easier this one was two dollars uh, I got some magnets for my Z palette blower and behold I did put that by the way. I did go ahead and I put one on the bling, doubling my bad, doubling. Sorry, Mac. <laughs> As you can see right here, and I did put a little post it. And it's in there. That is a very loved eyeshadow for a lot of quinceañeras. I got some MAC black on me. Um, it's a well-loved pink for a lot of my quinceañeras and brides. They just, they love that color. So, and no, that is not my eyeshadow collection. Just an example of how well this magnet works. Moving along, moving along. I know a lot of people have seen these um, hair curlers. These ones are the long ones. I think I'm going to give these away or um, throw it in my giveaway. Just because when I pull them out, they're fairly long. Fairly long. And there's only 10. I have thick hair. And my hair is medium length. So this, does not, this is not going to work for me at all. At all. So yeah. Planning on possibly giving these in my giveaway. We'll see. I mean, I haven't used them or anything. I would need like... Four more of these, three more of these, and the shorter length because my hair is not as long as 22 to 4, 22 to 24 inches in length. My hair is about 16 to 18 inches in length right now. Moving along quickly. I did order quite a bit of lashes just because I wanted to see how they were texture-wise, how they felt. Um... Not really too fond of one pair, so I'm really not going to mention that pair. Um, there are these ones. And of course, when you purchase things, they are, you know, oops, sorry. <laughs> They're like this. They don't have the name on them, so you really don't know. And this is a silver packaging. I don't know if the package is dead on to the real Huda Beauty. And then it has number seven, Samantha's. These are very, like I said, not what I expected at all. They are kind of scratchy. 
kind of scratchy not as scratchy they are really pretty don't get me wrong they are gorgeous i just don't see myself wearing a that thick of a band i am going to give these out give them out give them a try to see how heavy they are I mean, I got them mainly for, you know, just for to wear out on a dinner, um, Christmas dinner, Christmas party, and New Year's, New Year's parties. So, because they're very dramatic, they're very full. I got these for $2. And then they don't give that shine effect that some fake lashes do. That is why I purchased them. To kind of give them out give them a try and like I said again I wasn't sure exactly which ones they were because they just showed the lashes and then they give you numbers and then when I got them in the mail I saw that they were sorry let's try to put it back in their box and I did order two sets of these ones and then again these ones came like this they just had um, black and it said Demi Wispies on them and it ended up being red cherry lashes. Um, these ones actually have worn. These are very soft. They're very comfortable. The, la the lash band is fairly thin. It's not really a thick lash band. I love the way that they're short and they just flare out. It looks very natural, very beautiful. Um, I have ordered the red cherry lashes from the I Kate house before no wait hold on i take that back where did i purchase them i don't remember but i did order some um uh, through ikhouse.com and they have some really nice demi wispy lashes and you get them in a like a set and they're like ten dollars i believe it's like a set of six or six i believe it is something like that uh these ones i actually got through another um wholesale and ended up being 75 cents each the real ones but then i ordered these ones through the wish app and this is what I got and they're very comparable so I mean I'm very happy and pleased with this one and the last few things that I have uh and these ones were two dollars so and that actually came in a pack of six which I was very 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 did not know I didn't indicate it in the um, description box they just sent me six flashes for two dollars which was not bad I thought so, I went ahead and I ordered a, I originally ordered one of these, which are brush guards. This came in a pack of 10. They were $2. Very discouraging, by the way. Because they were $2 for 10. $2 for 20. So, you kind of have to go through the app. Look for what you're looking for. Actually, take your time. Be patient. And um, try to find the bang for your buck. So, like I said, just look and try to find the bang for your buck. Take your time to scroll and look and, you know, just the first couple of days, I just was like, what is this coming up on my Facebook? What is this for shop? And I downloaded it and I went through it and I was like, this is dangerous, 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 dangerous. My thoughts, my thoughts exactly. And last but not least, I did order some mascara wands and some lip wands. <laughs> Night glare. So, uh, $2, $2. And these came in a pack of 50 and 50 as well. And the lip wands and the mascara wands. Both came into 50s. And I believe that is everything for the Wish app. And then next on the agenda would be TJ Maxx. So, TJ Maxx, I did go ahead and get a, a fresh a face makeup towel removing, uh, removing towel. It's reusable, gentle, plush. It's really soft. So I just spritz a little bit of um, brush cleaner on the brush. Sorry, half frame there. <laughs> and I just go ahead and swish, 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 and we're good to go. We go on to the next client. Um, I wash it with Clorox. I really do. I'm just one of those people that washes everything with Clorox. Um, it's color safe bleach, of course. Uh, cause it is pink and I don't need any white weird stains on them. You'll be like, what is that? Mm-hmm. Like, no girl. I'm just clean and solitary. And then as I was checking out, I did see 
Kat Von D Light and Shade Blushes. These were $6.99. I got Hansel and Gretel and Bonnie and Clyde. We Bonnie and Clyde in here. So this one's Hansel and Gretel. It's kind of like a mauve brick tone. It's it's pretty. And then this is Bonnie and Clyde, which is like that mauve pink. So I'm one of those people who have OCD that have to dig to the back of a pile. If Even if it's food, I'm digging through the back. And this one actually has security tape all around it. So I know it hasn't been tainted in any demeans way. And then the last couple of two things that I did get from there as well. And these were $2.99 each. Were uh, some skizzas. Sipping off some skizzas. For the lashes. The only thing I don't like is that the tip curves, like that way. Well, I mean, it's good in a way, but I wish it was a flat tip. So I'm not poking myself. The hurts. You poke yourself, let me tell ya. Poke myself quite a bit of times. But I'm very happy with these. These are the Danielle. Danielle. And I got some of these. Hello, ladies. Hello. How are we tonight? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just feeling silly. Uh, lash applicator. So these are very grippy. I like them. Um, they're very comparable to the Sephora one. Don't worry. I will sanitize these. It just touch my very suffice. Um, so yeah, they're comparable to like Sephora. Um, I know the Wish App has some. They're all stainless steel um they come in a pack of three and i don't remember the the cost on those with shipping but they come in a pack of three so it has the really pointy ones it has the same ones as those and uh, they have another one i don't remember the style but they're pack of three and last but not least in the checkout stand as well with the blushes i found some of these they're the juicy couture Sorry, my glare is just not happening. Just a good tour. Los Angeles. Can you see that? Waste refill bags. So these were $5.99. They're the Juicy Couture ones. Uh, 120 bags, eight rolls. I use these. They look a little bit more, excuse me, they look a little bit more professional. To me, at least, that's me. Just me, my opinion. Um, they look a little more professional for me than I would be taking a plain garbage bag or a Safeway or Walmart bag or Shopco bag or whatever bag I'm taking. I just feel that these look a little bit more professional. Um, they do give like, um, like a clean scent to them. So as you're throwing things in there, you know, you smell that whoop of clean cleanness smell of a bag so yeah that is it for today guys deuces um don't forget to like comment subscribe let me know what you, your thoughts are on products or you know if you have an opinion on something leave it down below i don't i will not mind it all and i hope you guys have a merry christmas and happy new years and i will see you guys on my next one bye guys